Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Hello everyone. On this video I want to explain about trading in currency. Trading in currencies is the process of buying and selling currencies with the aim of generating profits. It involves the purchase and sale of one currency at a time and the exchange rate between two currency to determine the profit or loss generated in the trade. Sharia ruling on trading in currencies. It is permitted to trade in currencies as long as it is done in accordance with the following Sharia rules and regulations. First, before the dissolution, both parties must obtain equal value. Second, the exchange rate of the currency must be equal. Ownership in the sale of currency. First, when a contract is made to sell a number of currencies, the ownership of the entire amount must be taken. When the transaction ends, it is the liability of the contract. Second, the physical surrender is made by handing over. Agency in trading in currencies. An agent has the authority to execute a contract for the sale of a particular currency, as well as to take and give a value equivalent to that currency. Use of modern means of communication for currency trading. Bilateral contracts made between two parties in different places through contemporary communications media have the same law as the execution of such contracts in one place and in the appropriate place. Bilateral promise to purchase and sell currencies. If it is a binding promise, bilateral promises to buy and sell currencies are prohibited. However, promises of one person to party are permitted, even if they are binding. Exchange of currencies that are debts owed by the parties. A debt designated as a liability is exchanged for an amount denominated in that currency is called a conversion. If this conversion results in two different debts, the borrower must pay those debts. Combination of currency exchange and transfer of money. This transaction begins with a draft bank exchanging the currency for the actual or constructive currency, then transferred to the amount of currency purchased by the applicant for the transfer of the money. Forms of dealing in currencies via institution. Forbidden forms allow the organization's customers to enter more money for transactions than they actually have. They do this by using facility credit provided by the organization, which holds the currency of sale. This allows the customer to make transaction with more money than they can actually pay. Wassalamu alaikum.